It might seem an obvious statement to say that the fun of Devil May Cry 5 is all in its combat, but hear me out. I haven't played a Devil May Cry game since a brief attempt at the first one back on the PS2. I have heard that the series is based around a set of stylish attacks, making the combat itself look and feel cool, and that the player is rewarded for a variety of offense. This is definitely the case in DMC5. To me, the rankings at the end of each fight are not important. I know if I've done a good job or not. I know if the fight was fluid and stylish. And most importantly, I want to do better next time, or to try out a new idea. I want another fight. So much so that when walking around the hotel in Mission 2, I was jonesing for some more combat. That's why I wanted in on the secret mission I found. It was another opportunity to play. In between missions, the player can use the red gems acquired throughout the level to unlock new abilities and upgrade Nero. This is more important to me than the rankings. While I still feel the fights themselves are the reward, the ability to have more tools to play with is always welcome. By the end of my playtime, I was using the grapple, launching enemies in the air, smacking them back to the ground, unleashing overdrives, and firing at them in between. After I had put the game down, I remembered that I could charge the gun for a greater shot and I still haven't made use of the Exceed power yet. I have no doubt that as I engage in more fights and unlock more moves, the excitement that I'm feeling now will continue. There's always a chance to try something new, to be that little bit better. I know there's two other characters to do this with as well. Seeing I haven't been playing through the series, their relationships and the story is less interesting to me, but the combat itself made me understand why the series is so beloved. So, should you play Devil May Cry 5? If you like action games and the ability to look cool while stringing together a set of sword and gun combos, I think you'll have a lot of fun with this game. On the other hand, if you're not into third person action games or fighting games with inputs to learn and the need for situational awareness combined with an intermediate level of finger dexterity on the controller, this probably won't be for you. Although I should say, while I know my way around a video game controller, it didn't take me too long to start having fun with the combat in DMC5, so perhaps it's worth a shot. As always, I would love to hear what you think of Devil May Cry 5 and this video down in the comments. If you liked the video, why not buy me a coffee? There's a link in the description. If you'd like to help me out in other ways, please give the video a like, share it on your favorite social media sites, or subscribe if you haven't already. Until next time, I hope you're all having a wonderful day.